Welcome to this Wednesday's track battle. This week we've got a grand total of seven wheels and just five cylinders. On my right, we've got the new Morgan three-wheeler. On my left, we've got the cheapest and least powerful of all the Caterham 7s, the 160. We're at the rather picturesque and lovely friendly circuit, Mallory Park. Let me know if you know who that is. Let's go and find out which is quicker. So this is the Caterham 7 160. It's got just 80 brake horsepower and 79 pounds foot of torque. And it's making all that from a 660cc turbocharged three-cylinder engine. It's a Suzuki unit originally and I'd say it's really good. It does its best work certainly in the mid-range. And the gearbox perhaps isn't quite as nicely sort of snickety as before, but it weighs just 490 kilos this car. And it is great fun. Live rear axle, no dip, so you're not gonna do big slides early in the dry on the power. But nice little narrow chassis. It's great fun. The tires are really the limiting factor around here. Don't really need seconds for the hairpin. Third would probably be enough, it's got so much torque. Well, so much. The torque is what you're using really. Just constantly managing. Right, let's go for a lap. Cross the line. Down to this long right-hander. Gerard. Just managing it all the way around here. The little movement, trying to manage the power. And the, it's like one long slide. Managing the tyres. They run out to the exit up here. Bunch of games up here. Brake. Only need third coming into it. Really sharp on turning. But actually, just going on to launch it, try and get the traction. Run up the hill here. Oh, this is so much fun. Who needs lots of power? Over the crest down, brake for the hairpin. Again, only really need third here, tuck it in tight and get on the power nice and early, run it out wide. This corner is tricky, it's blind on entry and then falls away downhill, so you just run it out, get the most out of this little three cylinder engine, and back across the line. The agile little Caterham sets the target with a best time of 1 minute 5.7 seconds around Mallory's flowing curves.
turning early, huge attraction. Despite being a wheel down, Morgan has great traction out of the corners and is quick down the straights too. But those skinny front tyres mean it struggles on turning compared to the Caterham. In the end, it posts a best of 1 minute 8 seconds dead. So both are great wind and sideburns fun, but the significantly cheaper Caterham wins by a clear 2.3 seconds. If you can think of any other weird and wonderful track battles that you'd like to see in the future on Wednesdays, then please leave your comments in the box below. And if you enjoyed this track battle, then please remember to subscribe. <laughs>